Hello everybody, my name is Nathan and welcome to this video. In this tutorial video I'm going to show you how to fix the registry issue for prepared before when you um, can't uh, start the installation of a PMDG aircraft and the issue is going to appear on the screen right now. And now this is, uh, I'm doing this because there is a tutorial on the uh, on YouTube uh, about this but it did not match what I had and I had to figure out what to do with myself. It really isn't too hard, uh, so I'm just going to give you a few tips and I'm going to show you what I did if you have the same issue as me. Uh, okay, so the first thing that you do is uh, uh, press your Windows uh, button plus uh, at the same time the OR button, Romeo. You get, the, you get the run button and you click at the reg reggae edit as you can see. So registry edit, and when you do get that, you will get this um, little editor here. So the first thing that you do um, is uh, you go into uh, HT current user, and you go to software. And in this HT current user, you don't have to do that much really. Uh, all you have to do is scroll down until you see login margin, and you don't uh, you don't really touch the second log margin. You only touch the first the first one because I'm pretty sure you you will have uh, both. Um, as you can see here, um, I have you can say four folders. Here we go. They're not called folders. They're called keys, I believe. Uh, you have to create um, a few things, a few uh, stuff to these keys. So, for example, if some of them are missing, right, uh, you, you add the key and you must show two things, right? Uh, you must show the app path and uh, direct it to the directory, uh, direct it to the directory of where you have your prepared installed. And the, uh, then you have to just do this, the install it installed. I'll show you in a second here anyway. So, if you want to make a key, you go into like you, you just select Dr. Martin, select new and press key and you call it, I don't know, if you're missing a prepared uh, v2 then you call it that and obviously I don't need it so um, it doesn't really matter anyway, uh, when you get that there all you have to do then, you will get this always when you create your key, the default one but uh, what you have to do is you create, you have to create um, a new string value, call it a pass, and then press enter. Again, I can't call it a pass because I've already got an app path there. But when you when you click twice on it, left click twice on it, you'll get this. Now you won't get your um, path for prepared. That's where you go and copy it. So you go and copy your uh, prepared path and you paste it into here, right? That's the first thing. The second thing is you have to create this uh, this this file called dword 32 bit value, and you call it installed. And you have to um, when you when you when you open it, you have to uh, change the value data from zero to one always, right? Now these are, these are the two most important things you have to do in each in each and every single folder. I'm gonna show you. So if you are here, right, in HD current user software login margin, and you're missing any of these from V2 to V4, uh, you should have the SDK. You should have the SDK, I'm pretty sure. Um, then you start from V2, create a key for V2, and just create app path and installed, and do what as I said. If you're missing V3, um, again, you should do the same thing, and then V4, the same thing, right? So I hope you get that. So that's the first thing here, right? Um, then you go out of the you go out of the HD current user and go into HD lock machine. Now this is where the uh, where most of the work starts really. You go into HD local machine software and you go into I believe it was WoW 6432 node. And here and here um, you should I believe have another WoW 6432 node file. Just keep that open. And when you scroll up here again, in, in this first one, well, 6432 node file uh, folder, you should find another um, another Lockheed Martin. 
but my issue was right that I didn't have this Lockheed Martin uh, file folder inside this directory, inside this one. I know it may seem confusing, but I'm sure you figured it out. Um, so what you have to do here is click create the actual folder for the Lockheed Martin, and then click. This is all I've created, so this is all I created. So I did v2, v3, v4 inside the Lockheed Martin folder that I've created, and all I did, right? I've I've installed. Actually, I forgot to tell you about this one. Set of path. It's one. It's another one that you have to add. Um, and you have to add also the idle. Like there are a few things. There, there are a few things. Um, right. So remember, you, you have to create in the Lockheed Martin folder in each of those well 64 32 nodes. Um, if you don't have them already, of course. And you start from v2, right? You go to v4, and as you can see, it's all the same files here because I have done it. I didn't add anything extra. In some folders, there may be, there might be something extra, but here now. Okay. So the first thing, add path and installed. I'm sure you that already. The next thing is that you add in, in each of these is license, right? So you create another string value, call it license, exactly as I did, and just I don't know whichever license you have for your uh, prepared you, you just call it uh, you just uh, set the value uh, data as uh, academic or professional or professional plus right and uh, then the set of path right you do another string value and you add the set of path uh, the set of path to this the the diff, uh, again the root folder for prepared and for the for this, for a HD current user, you do the same thing. I've just forgotten. I've just forgotten about this. So I've done this a few days ago. But um, that's all you have to do. Uh, again, um, remember to continue from V2 to V4. It's very important. Make make sure to not make any spelling mistakes. And after you've done after you've done with the first well, 6432 node, you go into the second one, which is here. And it should be the Lockheed Martin again. Um, as you can see, I've only added up path and license in, the, in, the, in these guys. But anyway, again, V2, V3, V4, same thing. Uh, I've only got the up path and license. I've got no idea why, but I just do. It works. And that's what I have here. Okay. So I hope you, I hope you have an idea of, of, of what you have to do in order to fix that, because the issue is pretty much that. The installer is, is, is can't really um, find where you've installed your prepared folder and the PMG installers need to know that. So um, the most important thing here uh, is that you do what, I, do, do what I said pretty much and I wish you the very best of luck with, uh, with, with all of that. Remember to um, just don't make any spelling mistakes and uh, yes. Just don't be afraid to play around. Okay, that's it for me. Uh, my name is Nathan, and I hope you enjoyed. Uh, thanks for watching.